guys, welcome back to Magic TV. My name's Craig, it's six o'clock, it's time for a Magic Live. Now today I'm gonna to be doing a routine uh, called the Magician's Insurance Policy. This is as old as the hills, but it's still an amazing card revelation. It amazes me how many people don't do this. You can get it from all good Magic dealers. I'm gonna do it on Jack. Hello. Hey Jack. I've got a pack of cards here, buddy. Uh, and I am gonna show you possibly the world's greatest card trick. Oh, okay. definitely the world's greatest card trick. So I'm gonna cut the cards onto the table like this, right? Small packets, and as I do any time you want to, just say stop. Stop. There, do you want one more card or is that it? That's it. Have a look at that card, remember it, don't forget it. And I'm gonna look away, and as I look away, uh, when I dribble the cards down into the uh, table, you're just gonna put the card back anywhere you want to. Uh, just put okay. the card in there and um, Take your time, Jack. Let's try that again. I'm going to go through. You're just going to put the card back anywhere you want. So there you go. Lovely. And do you want to shuffle the cards or do you trust me? No, you don't. That's fine. Okay, give them a shuffle. By the whole of the potion. Oops. I was thinking of the five of spades, Jack. That was very good. <laughs> I'm sure you were. I was. It was amazing. So, Jack, this is the greatest trick of all time. I'm just going to spread the deck on the table and I'm going to go back and forth with my finger like this. And you're just going to say stop anytime you want to. Stop. Right there? Yeah. That card there. If that was your card, would that be a good trick? That'd be a really good trick. The nine of spades. That would be. That would have been a good trick. Um, let me try that one more time. It's my fault, I shouldn't have picked you. Anytime you want to, just say stop. Stop. There. Jack, would that be a good trick if that was your card? Yeah. Was your card the queen of hearts? No. Brilliant. <laughs> well, unfortunately, I'm not gonna be here all day. Unfortunately, <laughs> I have failed, but don't worry. I have uh, a way of dealing with this because you see what I actually have is I have insurance against the card trick going wrong. You see, everybody gets insurance these days for anything. You can get insurance for pets, you can get insurance for life insurance, you can get house insurance, car insurance. These days you can get insurance for everything. So why would you not get a magician's insurance policy, Jack? That's right. This is magician's insurance policy. This no, no, this is this is this is great. This is the magician insurance policy. This will insure me against ever getting a trick wrong. Let me show you. Uh, conditions of this policy. Let's just have a quick look. Any of all persons participation must uh, must part. Any of all persons participating must not heckle the magician. You can't be mean to me, Jack. That's what that's saying. The policy is only valid Monday through Friday and weekends only. Are we okay with that? Is that are we good? <laughs> <laughs> we die, basically. If the magician's rabbit does jump out and attack the audience, this policy is null and void. Have you seen the rabbit around recently? I hope not. Okay, we're good then. The only rabbit I've seen recently is in Sarah's drawers. <laughs> all claims again. <laughs> All claims against the magician must be filed only after the magician has been paid in full and left the bill. I'm not getting paid for this, so don't worry about it. Um, the policy gives the magician the right to use real magic. Exceptional. This policy is only valid after the audience believes in magic. Do you believe in magic? Well, okay, that's all good. Good stuff. This policy guarantees the magician will not fail in acting condition number eight. It means the trick must go right. Finally... Uh, the magician does have a final opportunity to magically find the spectator's card. If the magician has failed every attempt, which I have, uh, giving the magician the right to enact a big finish. Please hold all applause until the magician finishes his big finish. Okay, so I'm going to give you the big finish and then you're going to give me a big round of applause. Okay. Um, this policy never fails. What was the name of your card, Jack? King of Hearts. Really? Well, let's just have a look because right inside here we have Fuck off. the King of Hearts. Remember the deal. Thank you. Big round of applause. There it is, the King of Hearts. That is the Magician's Insurance Policy. It's as old as the hills, but it's super fun and really cool. Do me a favor, let me know what you think in the comments down below. You want to see more videos like this, like the video, subscribe to the channel. I'll be back again tomorrow at 6 o'clock with another Magic Live. I'll see you then.